This door is a timed Can door. Please, okay. So you all have to get through here in 20 seconds, all right? <laughs> so if you could be ready to run and just go down the slope and wait, wait at the bottom. Today, John Cull from Qantas is a tour leader. Right, run, quick, 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 quick. One more, right. You don't have to run, I was only joking. John's hoping to impress a group of travel agents who've come to see just what it is they're selling. They are boarding a jumbo jet and heading for business class where a seat to Australia and back costs over £4,000. <laughs> with all the latest toys thrown in. You're allowed to play with your little things while you're up here, if you like. <laughs> These are little lights, individual lights, and I was just told a few minutes ago that our um, customer services department had a complaint from a passenger who couldn't get the steward to come. Apparently she was shouting into here, thinking it was a speaking <laughs> tube. Must have been a very elderly lady. <laughs> right. Go on. OK, madam. John is aware of the fierce competition between airlines to sell business class seats. He hopes the agents are suitably impressed. Very nice. They are making the most of their moment of luxury. Now, where's Madam? I think they're just bringing it. <laughs> Bobby Telly's out. Unfortunately, they don't work because the um, system's not on properly. But that's your TV. Right, OK, then. Put your seats back. Fluff your pillows, if you could, please. John's taking the travel agents to see a very exclusive part of the plane. It's strictly out of bounds to all passengers. If you want to turn left again... <laughs> John's travel agents are in for a surprise. You may often have seen crew disappearing into a coat locker on an aircraft and not seen them reappear. Well, I'm now going to show you exactly where they go. OK, this is a bit windy. Hang on tight and mind your head. The beams are very low. All right, if you don't want to come all the way up, you can just have a little look. But I just thought I'd show you this. Some bunks up here. All right. Tucked away at the rear of the plane is the crew's own secret hideaway, equipped with six bunks. During a 13-hour flight, each crew member is entitled to just three hours of horizontal rest. It's not normally this hot up here, of course. Well, it depends on what the crew are doing, I suppose. <laughs> John's duties are done. On behalf of everyone here, we'd like to thank you very much, John. Pleasure. I've enjoyed it. I've enjoyed seeing you all. Everyone, clapping for you. I seem quite happy, so I'm going to go for a meal now and I'm going back to check-in, unfortunately.